Okay, we're here on stadium court number two. This match is going to be between Julia Cohen of the United States and Eva Beer Nerova. Excuse me if I said that wrong. Of Czechoslovakia. The important thing to notice about this point is that Cohen, the American who's serving, gets her first serve in in the very first point of the match, and thus it's a good start. This point is a good way to play a defensive player. Come in behind a short ball, put pressure on them, draw the error. Here we see Cohen serving again. She's missed her first serve, but notice she keeps her feet moving, goes into the same routine every time for her second serve. Her opponent puts a lot of pressure on her right away, but she plays a good defensive ball. Then they go back into the point. She goes right back on the offensive. This point is a classic case of get the ball back in play. Cohen plays a cat and mouse game, keeping it deep. Then she hits a short one, but puts it back in the court and draws the error. Here we see Julia serve. Notice how she goes straight down and straight up. Kind of a hop serve, slightly abbreviated. Similar to Rod. This is a great serve to use if you have shoulder issues or if you're just having trouble with the complexity of the traditional serve with the longer backs. This point illustrates why hitting cross court is better. You hit the ball earlier, you pull your opponent out of the court. Cohen's hitting down the line and gets in trouble. Here we see why Cohen ultimately wins the match. She makes Bernasova hit great shots like this one over and over. No one can do that. Here's another point that goes Julia's way. As you can see, she's keeping the ball deep and high, forcing her opponent, Bernasova, back. Ultimately, she will draw the error, even though she isn't offensive at the times when she could be. The Russian could also be offensive somewhere here and come to the net to force the issue on some of these high balls, but doesn't, and pays the price.